Hello everyone, my name is Kempty Hibbit, and welcome back to our 1.18 Survival Let's Play. And today we are going to be tackling this house behind us. It is that medium house that is basically looks like two houses smushed together. <laughs> um, and we're going to go ahead and get started on that today. Um, we're going to do something a little bit different, I think. I am going to basically tell you a little bit about what we're doing. I'm thinking, and then I'm going to show you what's in my chest here, which is all the materials I need to do this build, and then I'll walk you through all the things that I did at the end. So, what I'm going to do is I look at this thing and I immediately think duplex. So I'm going to turn it into a duplex. I'm actually going to divide it in half and make it two houses that are connected in the middle, and they're going to have two separate doors. We'll put an upstairs on them. It's going to look really cool. Uh, the materials I need, besides the materials that are already in the building, um, if you notice, though, I did take out the table and the stair and the chest, and I just got a bunch of beds in here because <laughs> this is where I was breeding my villagers for a while. Um, but yes, this is all the materials that I am going to need for this build. Um, if I still had the table and the chair in there, it would be one less fence post, one less, uh, what is that thing called, pressure plate, and one less stair. Um, but everything else should be exactly what we need. There are, you can take a screen pick real quick, uh, screen capture, see, or pause the video, write down what you need, but this is what we're going to need for this build today. And let's get into it. Uh, first thing I've got to do, and you know, yeah. So we're going to go right into a time lapse, and I will talk to you about everything once it's done. time-lapse and as you can see we are done um, so yeah I changed the direction of the roof I didn't like the double peaked roof I did a peak roof all, I did a full roof all the way across 
uh, which means I've got windows on the upstairs on the ends. Of course, on the other end, you can't really see it. But let's go around and talk about what I did. Um, so I did put some lanterns on the outside for lighting and on the inside. Of course, I followed the same exact build pattern and palette, block palette that I've been using. So I had the oak trap doors down at the bottom, spruce trap doors up at the top. Except for this one spot, I realized I could have used a spruce trap door there. Uh, but I ended up with more oak trap doors than I had spruce. So if you want to add two spruce doors to put there, spruce trap doors, I mean, to put there. Um, oop, I didn't put my oak trap door here. Uh, and I probably could have used another stone stair there. And I think I did the same thing in the back. Nope, I remembered it here. So, yeah. So I realized I did have enough of those. I would miss two when I was counting. So if you want to add two more spruce trap doors to that count, <laughs> to add that. Or you could just leave that spot blank. It looks fine either way. Um, I'll show you the inside. We did a little dining area. The little furnace with the chimney and a little crafting table and the upstairs is two beds with a chest and I've got a lantern up here as well uh, both houses are pretty much the same as far as the downstairs upstairs I put the two beds together okay, oop, and he's already going up to go to bed <laughs> they've been missing their beds um, so yeah and I did put the chimneys on top with the fire, the campfires to show the smoke. And I did the chimneys at two different levels just to get, add some visual interest. And of course, I have those wonderful deep slate tile stairs. Hello, buddy. How are you? <laughs> so, yeah. Oh, seriously? That's my bed. Thank you. Um, I did end up with some extra materials. Um, I miscounted the deep slate tile stairs. Uh, it was good to have a little more extra. Um, this did run into the other house over here at the top, so it took a little finagling to get all the pieces to fit together. But I was able to do that, and it doesn't look half bad. Um, so yeah, that is our upgrade of our house. Um, I hope you enjoyed this. I am actually going to... So there we go. I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, it is nighttime, and I hope there's nothing that's going to attack me. But <laughs> okay, I, I really do hope you enjoyed the time lapse and the build of this. Like I said in my last video, I am going to be doing a couple of short videos just to kind of bulk up my buffer um, So while we're working on the house. So by the time this one comes out, we would have already closed on the house and would have already started work. So... Wish us luck, and I hope you enjoyed the video. Until next time, bye!